This is the stretch of Boomer Road that Grady Lambert liked to run on before he left Stillwater for his cross-country run in support of health care workers. His family says that his mission is now their mission. In March, Grady Lambert began his run across the country in support of health care workers. His family says that while he's still in critical condition from being struck by a truck, he will pass away in the next few days. But they say his run isn't over. I said, what do you want me to do in case something happens? And he said, Mom, I want you to take my ashes and I want you to finish my run. Along the way, he stopped at numerous medical facilities, volunteering or just offering support. But now, after this tragic incident, his mission passes on to those he loves. He just felt that he, they needed to be shown some compassion and to love on them, and that's what his mission was. The community he was a part of will remember him forever, including Lincoln Academy, where, as an avid reader, he's credited with starting their library. Now it's going to be the Grady Lambert Memorial Library. And while the family is grieving, they're taking the next steps in honor of their son. We've set up a scholarship that will go to a Lincoln Academy graduate that's going to nursing school. And if you'd like to help pay for hospital costs, the GoFundMe and a link to that scholarship fund will be on the As Seen On section of KOCO.com. In Stillwater, Colby Terrell, KOCO 5 News.